Supreme. Congratulations, Weapons Madrid. Thank you, Steve. We have dared, and I'm using the word dared, to strip down, literally strip down, both the mindsets. If you do not fear death, you have no fear of the enemy. We've shown this is what the American mindset is. This is what the radicalized mindset is. Now, it's up to the audience to decide which one is good or bad. This is what I have become. This is what you have created. And now, there's no going back. That's Afrin, the main character who plays, uh, who's played by Samantha. She actually plays you and me. She plays them. She plays the audience. She plays everybody who watches the two worlds, the two mindsets, and is not sure which one should we go for, which one should we sympathize. This is your kid. This is yours. Your responsibility. No one can ever take that from you. We would like people to watch the movie and um, start a dialogue amongst ourselves. The audience response and the response of fellow filmmakers to Afreen was simply overwhelming and outstanding. If somebody who is maybe thinking of getting radicalized watches this movie will think whether it's worth it and that personally as a filmmaker as a director would be the biggest award i can get if i can save that one life it's also brave to do a film like that because i think lots of filmmakers shy away from tackling a political situation or a movie like that or story very good film, I really enjoyed it, you know, it's tense, gripping, it deals with the subject. I, I, I was really inspired by, by this movie because it's super, it felt very personal and but also universal. So I, I, I want to thank you so much and I encourage people to, to really watch this film. Well done.